Um, I chose personal training as a career because I like the social aspect of it. Um, just the fact that you're a part of someone's life um, on a daily basis, weekly basis. Um, you just make that connection. Um, you, you, you know, you, you, you make an impact on their lives as far as improving on their, not only their health, but you know, sometimes the, the social aspect, people come to personal training not only for health benefits, but the social aspect as well. I was leaving another job and uh, actually I've been a personal trainer ever since, um, way back in the Philippines and Australia as well. So I kind of took a break a little bit from personal training just to see if I'm good at anything else. <laughs> um, but keep coming back to personal training, that's more of a calling, so this is where I'm supposed to be. And I do enjoy it very much. So you practice what you preach pretty much. Um, very passionate about um, just being better. Um, you know, you're being better every day, you know. Um, you keep improving. Um, there's always things that um, you need to improve on as far as health and wellness comes. So there's, especially with the fitness industry, there's so many trends um, nowadays where people are kind of going in and out of trends and that's where we come in as far as making sure that it's, it's the right one and it's not a dud or it's not just a fad. Um, we do our research as well and make sure that people don't hurt themselves and educate them as far as what to do out there as far as um, you know, getting better. Don't give up. Um, if you're about to start um, working out or working on your, on your health, um, it, it doesn't happen overnight. The thing is, you just have to stay consistent. Um, if you have any questions, that's where we come in as far as making sure that you know you are not intimidated here in the gym and you know that you're comfortable here.